All right, so we're on a 2011 Tran, Transcat, Transcat uh, catamaran tunnel hull, very shallow draft vessel with six to eight inch draft. Uh, starting out at the helm here. Uh, vessel is powered by a Evinru 150 e -Tech. You got a, a polling platform there, and uh, there's also a polling platform that goes on the on the front, which is right there, uh, and that goes on the bow of the boat, bolts down. Uh, this uh, this boat is definitely decked out with lots of features, and is a certified redfish killer. All right, so here's our helm. We have a fuel tank under there. You got a battery. You got three batteries under there. You got your uh, battery charger. Uh, at the helm, we've got our fuel fill. We got running lights, deck lights, GPS, horn, uh, jack plate trim right there. Got a real nice stainless steel wheel. We got our BRP throttle. And we got trim tabs. Uh, and then we have a power pole back there as well. There's also some uh, handheld remotes that go with it. Uh, your two gauges are your water pressure and your tack. And then you've got uh, oil, temp, check engine, and low oil alarms. Uh, over here we have automatic aerator. So you can set it to automatic or manual. Got our stereo right there. There's another 12 volt. Um, and then we have two units up here, both Hummingbird, one's a 787C2I, the other one's a 385CI, and uh, he primarily uses one for a fish finder, which has a transducer on the boat, and the other one is primarily used for a GPS, but they both have GPS fish finder capabilities that are both operational. Okay, let's close that. Lots of rod holders all the way around the boat. We've got LED lighting. Uh, we've got nice uh, LED forward facing uh, spreader lights here. The leaning post uh, that I was leaning on is an uh, aluminum frame. You got a cooler under it. Does that come with the boat? Okay. Go back up front. We've got an aluminum frame here as well with another cooler. And then uh, two storage compartments under the the forward deck here and uh, let's see if you can see in there but huge storage goes all the way to the front of the boat and then uh, over here we have this beauty which is a uh, Minn Kota Riptide iPilot and how does that work? Fully automatic GPS controlled GPS controlled so you can it's like autopilot um, and you have a external device that you wear around your neck that you plot the chart that you want to take. Right. So remote, and, totally and, remote control. and this uh, this trolling motor will remotely take you on a pre-planned GPS route, self-correcting for wind, currents, and everything else within a five feet range of accuracy. So really, really nice uh, feature on the boat. There's another trolling motor on the back which is a, a Minn Kota Riptide as well. And you use that for? Just, just a helper. Just a helper, okay. Gotcha. Uh, polling platform, by the way, up here. Uh, really tall, and there's another piece for it is a, that's up there, it's the handrail. And then we've got Sea Star hydraulic steering. I'm looking over the bimini top. Uh, there's your driving position. And then uh, this is a slip resistant, easy to clean coating on the deck as well. Uh, we've got a, a push pole bracket uh, right there. And right there for a push pole that's uh, stored underneath. We'll go take a look at that next. All right, we're on outside. Uh, it is a train cat. There's your rear rear boat. We've got Lenco trim tabs. We've got a 
shaw wing cavitation plate built onto the motor. And there's the uh, push pole. He said it's a 24 foot, 26, 26 foot carbon fiber. And uh, got a four blade prop here. There's your transducer. You got a blade power pole there. Eight foot power pole. Uh, let's see, what else? Hydraulic jack plate up there. And that uh, polling platform up there is made by Hankos. So if you're a local, you know them. We got stainless steel pull up cleats. This is an all aluminum trailer. Got uh, portion suspension on the trailer. Okay, portion suspension. Any brakes? No. No brakes. No problem. Trailer's in excellent condition. Boat is in excellent condition. There's your spare tire. I'll come around here and take a look at what that uh, hull design looks like. Got a tunnel that goes straight through the middle. And he said this thing is very steady on the water. Uh, very shallow draft. Beautiful package, all offers are welcome.